Okay, now on summing up radicals, um, the first step you do is simplify each radical separately. So, oops, so the, you got 2 root 50, so we're going to simplify that root 50 into 25 and 2 and 5 and 5, so there's a pair. There's a 2 out front, so the 5 times the 2 makes 10 out front, with a leftover 2 in the root. 245 breaks into uh, 5 and 49. 49 is a perfect square, so you have um, 7 root 5 there. 125 um, breaks into, again, 5 and 25, which is a perfect square. You can keep going. A pair of fives, there's already a 3 out front, so you've got 15 root, and then this 5 stays inside the radical. When you're adding radicals, you have to add like radicals. You treat them like variables. So you could reread this as 10x plus 7y plus 15y. And so you're going to add the 7 and the 15. So 10 root 2 doesn't add to anything, but then 7 root 5 plus 15 root 5. So we have 7 root 5s and 15. So we add that, and you have 22 root 5s. Okay, and so... There's the, there's the uh, simplified answer. On the bottom one um, here, we've got to distribute the 4 root 6 through the problem. So distributing the 4, you can only multiply numbers and numbers and roots and roots. So you'd have negative 12 root 12 because 4 times 3 is 12, 6 times 2 is 12 plus, because negative and negative is positive, 20 root 18 plus 5 root 48. So now it works just like the last problem, once we did the distribution. Break, simplify each. So 12 breaks into 4 and 3, 2 and 2, there's a pair, there's a negative 12 out front, so you'd have negative 24 root 3 for the 3 left over. 18 breaks into 6 and 3 and 2 and 3. So you got a pair of 3's with a 20 out front. So plus 60 root 2 for this root left over. 48 uh, breaks into 2 and 24. 24 breaks into 8 and 3. 8 breaks into 4 and 2 and 2 and 2. So I kind of ran out of room there, but we've got a pair of twos here, a pair of twos here, and a three left over. So um, in the prime factorization. So we've got two times two is four, times five is twenty. So you'd add plus twenty root three. So make sure I did the right five times two is ten, times two is twenty, yep, twenty root three. So then you add again the like roots. So negative 24 root 3 here, and positive 20 root 3 here. Use a little commutative to rearrange them and add them together. And you'd have negative 4 root 3s plus 60 root 2s. And we have a simplified radical.